Percy works at the big station. He loves playing with the trucks all day long, flashing them around, making fun of them, undermining them, making them feel inferior, spoiling films for them, trolling them online. But his favourite job is when he brings Gordon his coaches for the express. Here are your coaches, Gordon, he proudly announced. Percy, these aren't my coaches. Percy was embarrassed. Oh dear, please don't tell the fat controller. But it was too late. Percy, did I hear you correctly? Did you just call me fat? Is that how you all feel? The engines didn't know what to say. Thomas and his friends hadn't seen the fat controller for days. I feel bad about Sir Topham Hat. We need to show him that body image is important and that he should feel confident, however he looks. But how do we do that? I think I have the answer. After weeks of preparation, it was time to visit the Fat Controller. I can't wait to see the look on his face. He will be surprised. The engines were shocked. But, 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 what happened to you? Uh, this is all your fault. It was Dr. Engine. Your heartless name calling and body shaming is responsible for his dangerous weight loss and your attempts at making him feel better have just made matters worse. Thomas and his friends were very sorry for what they had done. Everyone agreed that, whether dangerously malnourished or morbidly obese, everybody is just fine as they are, and they should be accepted and celebrated. Uh, well, no, I, I didn't say that exactly. Well, I guess I'll be going back to the chippy four times a day. Ah, uh, well, I don't recommend that at all. And as for us, I guess we'll be on a diet of water and slimming pills for six months. <laughs> That's just bloody stupid. Please, can I just get everyone's attention, please? Am I the only one talking common sense here? Really? Is everyone just going to ignore me? Fine!